I'd wanted to make a film about our first years in Australia by going to the, the sites and the houses we'd lived in at, over that time and talk about the things that had happened to us while we were there. My mother agreed with this when I asked her if she was interested in helping me. Um, my father, Peter De Bruyne and mother Hilla Honda migrated to Australia in 1958 when I was about eight years old. In fact, I was eight on the boat when we came out and I was an only child. My father was a bricklayer and he expected to do well. We didn't plan to stay long here uh, because we had bought a block of land in North Altona, oh, the 7th yeah, yeah. Avenue, and we were going to build a house. But your father started to behave so strange, uh, then the house didn't get finished. Yeah. And he went to Royal Park? Uh, he went, and then he went to Royal Park for treatment. Oh, we lived in the bungalow at the back, eh? I was on the back of the house, yes, and there were very nice people. Uh, one night he, he got up and he looked out the window and he started to howl like a dog. And it was so spooky, all the dogs started to bark around it. And he switched the light on when maybe a hundred times on and off. When he was for the first time in the hospital, he said, oh, that is what is the problem, and I will fix him up. Yeah, yeah. And then he got treatment. And I got, he got uh, shock treatment and everything. Yeah, yeah. Then, so you think it's genetics? Yes, I think so. Well, I mean, that's a, worry, the... that's a worry for me then, because it could yeah. happen to me then, couldn't it? Yeah, because... Well, what do you, well, yes. No, no, but I mean, he had two sisters who were in mental hospital, so there must be something genetic in it, otherwise, why would the whole family have? Family have it, and another family not.